The DNA of three people was used to create eight babies born through IVF. Let me explain. A new study published in the New England Journal of Medicine reveals that scientists from Newcastle University in the UK and Monash University in Australia use DNA from three people to help prevent genetic diseases in IVF-conceived babies. The method involves transferring the genetic material from both the mother and father into a donor egg with healthy mitochondria in order to prevent life-threatening diseases caused by mitochondrial mutations. This process is called mitochondrial donation treatment, or MDT. It works by fertilizing the mother's egg with the father's sperm, extracting the nucleus and placing it into the donor egg that has had its own nucleus removed. The resulting embryo contains DNA from three individuals, DNA from the biological parents, and healthy mitochondria from the donor. The team conducted the procedure in 22 women, and the procedure led to the birth of eight healthy babies. The first reported births from this technique were in 2023. This treatment became possible after the UK amended its laws in 2016 to allow the procedure. In 2017, Newcastle University received the first license to perform it. According to the researchers, none of the eight babies born through this method has shown signs of mitochondrial disease. Currently, 35 families in the UK have been approved to use this technique. In contrast, the procedure is banned in the United States, but legal in countries like the United Kingdom and Australia.